my name is Kristen and I work at GitLab and I'm going to take you through the new GitLab and Figma plugin. Specifically, we'll go through how to get the plugin and how to get authenticated. So when you're in Figma, from the top left Figma icon, you can come down and hit plugins, which is in the left side nav, and then you're going to see featured plugins and go to browse all and search for GitLab. So here it is. We can hit install and we've got the plugin. Now, almost as easy to get it authenticated, you come over to a frame in one of your art files in Figma and selecting the frame, we're gonna go to plugins, GitLab, uploads designs to GitLab, and it's gonna prompt us here for our access token. And so I'll show you how to get that. Now, design management in GitLab is free, so you can actually sign up for a free account in GitLab and make this work. So from our GitLab Figma plugin project here, I'm actually going to navigate up to my profile and go to the settings option. Inside here, I'm gonna to go to access tokens and I'm gonna generate a token that I can use over in Figma. So for me, I'll just call it Figma. I won't have an expiry date on it. And I'm gonna give it access by checking these boxes and then clicking the green button to create my personal access token. Now, I'm gonna click that button off the screen just because it's going to display my token and I, I'm just gonna copy paste it. So now I've got the token ready to go. I come back to Figma, paste it here, and we're live. So now we've got an active GitLab plugin where it's encouraging me to paste a GitLab issue URL. So we're gonna test this. <clears throat> so I've got these two frames and I do have a test issue open right here. Now this issue is just sitting here for testing purposes, but typically, we have the issue title, the description, and then down below, we've got discussion and designs. Right now, there are no designs on this issue. We haven't uploaded any or copy pasted them in, but we're gonna use the plugin to do it. So I'm going to copy the URL of this issue, paste it here. It does a search and pulls back the issue to verify it. And then I select the frame I want to send and click upload. So in a few seconds, we've got that image uploaded onto the issue. Now from within GitLab, we can open this up, we can have discussions on it, we can discuss um, waiting as, with the engineer team, with the PM, and we can go back and forth in terms of solidifying this design to have it move forward into um, being built and then into production. We can also upload multiples. So let's say I want to send both of these up. Maybe I'll do a modification on the first one and I'll also send this new one up. So I selected both and hit upload. And now both have gone. If I refresh, we've got the most up-to-date designs sent up from Figma. Now on our roadmap and what we're going to do next is link back to Figma. So, so from here, we should be able to edit it back in Figma. So we'll have um, an edit button that, that lights up, as well as hopefully in the future, deeply integrating our, the users, the conversations, and other things that we can get between the two products to make it a more seamless experience between design, product, and engineering.